It's back to business for Miami Commissioner Joe Carroyo after a jury found him liable and ordered him to pay more than $60 million. He was at a commission meeting today. Local 10 News reporter Annalise Garcia is live outside of Miami City Hall with the details. Annalise. Hey ladies, so today was the first time that the commission came together since that trial happened with Commissioner Carroyo. Now today, during the meeting, uh, the verdict was not discussed. Thursday, the first commission meeting since the bombshell verdict against Commissioner Joe Carollo. We waited outside City Hall to catch the commissioner on his way in, but he didn't park in his usual spot, and it appears he used the back entrance. Inside the building during public comment, several community members directly addressed Commissioner Carollo. I think Commissioner Joe Carollo should resign. I think you're a criminal and shame on you. Last week in federal court, jurors sided with two Miami businessmen who accused Carollo of violating their First Amendment rights, alleging Carollo used his office as commissioner to harass and damage the reputations of their businesses and tenants. After trial, the jury awarded the two business owners more than $63 million in damages. So who pays? We are not liable for it. Not a single penny from the $63 million in the city of Miami is liable. The city released a statement saying that taxpayers bear no financial responsibility to that $63 million judgment, but they are already on the hook for the commissioner's legal fees, about $2 million. The city has not provided an updated total figure, and whatever that is will not include lawyer fees related to Carollo's expected appeals. We caught up with Commissioner Reyes, who clarified how part of this gets paid. There is an insurance that pays for the, for the, uh, that, 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 that the city has to protect itself when they have to uh, pay for outside counsel. As for Carollo's future, even though it's not criminal, members of the community gathered outside City Hall Monday to express their concerns and how they believe he should step down. The madness needs to stop. We all deserve better. Joe Carollo has to go. And we do expect to hear from Carollo today. As soon as we do, we will let you know what he says. I'm live in Miami. Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.